it's quite a view and I've seen plenty. Round and round, a crooked waltz, the wheel of time. This hope, hope is a different kind of heavy. Welcome to episode five of Wendy's World, Ojalá. The influence of the Moors in Spain pops up all over the place in village names, architecture, agriculture and irrigation techniques, also in language. In today's episode, I'm bringing you to the little art oasis of Ojalá. In Spanish, Ojalá comes from the Arabic saying Masha'ala, meaning should God will it or let's hope. Located about 20 kilometers from Valencia City, Ojalá presents visual art exhibitions, live music and dance concerts, often combined with a huge vegetarian feast, and classes ranging from visual art to live music improv to making pottery or natural creams and soaps. It seems very fitting to me that today's special guest, Heidi Ebrich, is the founder of this beautiful place, as she has a wide range of talents too. Heidi is a classically trained Baroque violinist. I've had the joy of playing with her on a few of my songs, as well as some klezmer pieces with the band Klezmerama. We'll be playing two songs together today, but first let's meet Heidi as she describes one of my favorite things, happy coincidences, and how she branched from playing with a Baroque bow to making Baroque bows with her company, Cat and Bow. It must be about our second year here, our third year. By chance, there was, um, there was a course in Valencia given by a French Baroque bow maker. And it was also completely by chance because I actually couldn't go because friends of mine were supposed to be coming and we were going to play in various villages around, also an accordionist and, and a bass player from Holland. And, and then it got cancelled, I couldn't come. And it was exactly this moment, and I just thought, this is fate. It's telling me I have to go on this course. Every page we turn in life helps new chapters unfold. And as we discuss Heidi's transition from living in major cities like London and Amsterdam to the countryside here in Spain, 
We touched on the gift of having space and yet another path for her as a farmer. I mean, that's the fun, you know, living here and living in the countryside, you have space to be able to do these things, you know. When I was living in my little flat in Amsterdam, it would have been impossible. Yeah, exactly. But now I have a little studio for myself, workshop, and yeah. Mm. Mm. And then speaking of the countryside where we are, you're also a farmer. You have an official <laughs> certificate as a, as a carob farmer. As a goes. carob, yes. Yes, <laughs> yes, yes. So the carob uh, harvest was just, just it was last just, week. Yeah, it was just last week, absolutely. Yeah, we finished was, it off, yeah, in time a, for the concert, because otherwise the whole area would have been full of carob. Just a couple of days ago, you had your CD release for Besarebia. Mm -hmm. Besarabia, I should yeah. say. Um, how was that? It was in here, where yeah. we're about to go right yeah. away. Yeah, it was fantastic. This was actually it was a sort of private concert for the people who are patrons that mm -hmm. had supported us on GoFundMe. We'd done a GoFundMe crowdfunding project for it. And so this is this the was, second album. Yeah, it's the second. Yeah, full length. I haven't album. heard the, I haven't yeah. heard this album yet. I've yeah. only heard the first one, so I'm very yeah. excited myself. Good. And it's all about animal. It's called Animal Republic. And it's all different tunes and stories about animals and their desires and their wishes and their... Yeah. <laughs> so you can understand why this is close to my heart. <laughs> Shall we go in? Yep. Okay. <laughs> go ahead. The Ojala site has been a ruin frequented by shepherds and their animals for years, but was fixed up over a decade ago and became Ojala around seven years ago. It still uses well water, and although their internet is better than mine at home, <laughs> everything is run by solar power. This little room where you can see some glimpses of art from one of the classes on the walls used to be the stable and feeding area for the animals, but now has a little stage and seats about 50 people. That's in the cozy pre-COVID days, of course. <laughs> You also teach classes as well. Um, improv, improv is a... I've been doing improvisation, pre-improvisation, yeah. yeah. And Which is another one of your passions too. It's another of my passions, yes. <laughs> and you also work with some dancers, what is that collective? Yeah, called? yeah, Peng Jam, yeah. which Peng is Jam. electronic music with dancers, yeah. In Valencia. Um, in Valencia, yeah. Because yeah. 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 right now we're about how, many, how far from Valencia? This is about 20 yeah. kilometers from Valencia, 25 kilometers from Valencia, yeah. Well, this has been very fun, but now I think it's time for some music. I wrote this next song, The X Beyond the Y, for my upcoming album, First There Were Feathers. You are the first to hear it, as it won't be properly recorded until late January 2022. So I hope you like it, and here we go. Oh, <laughs> difference between night and day reflected in the games we play our methods and our reasons less than one in ten the truth not touch this algorithm well defined like bits of rhyme is this russian roulette Ooh, laugh it off cast a rock through the dirty pain of our pretension Ooh, mythic talk shadow walk through the silver stream of sweet persuasion You know how the tale unfolds, a flash of light, then on we go. The pools where the poets float, we're shifting the equation. Take the hit again, trust in the beauty of collision. Accidents that fade and step the X beyond the Y. Ooh, laugh it off, cast a rock through. The dirty pain of the pretension Ooh, mythic talk, shadow walk through Ooh, the silver stream of sweet persuasion. <laughs> Oh, so much to 
to say the difference between night and day reflected in the games we play our methods and our reasons less than one in ten the truth might touch this algorithm well defined like bits of rhyme is this russian roulette <sighs> Beautiful, Heidi. Thanks so much for joining us today. We're going to play a bit of a classic klezmer tune called Odessa Bulgar as we leave Ojala and serenade some of the captivating carob trees that surround us. All the best to you. Ojala. Thank you. 